Hello friends, in today's video we're going to be changing uh, control arm uh, ball joint on this uh, Mitsubishi Charisma Lancer. So I'm going to show you the location of it. Right, there we go. That is the ball joint here, this one here, to the hub. Okay, uh, that's uh, failed on MOT. So there is uh, one bolt here to undo one bolt here to undo just here okay so that's the anti-roll bar linkage bolt and then one here just here one here and uh, a clamp here which we have to undo to take the arm out this is a push fit uh, bolt joint all right we're gonna apply plenty of WD-40 on the nuts which we have to undo Okay, one here. I've mentioned the clamp here. This is a clamp we have to undo. Plenty of WD-40, no hesitation. Okay. And then this one here. Okay, and then the anti roll bar linkage. Right, so now we're gonna undo the bolts. Just gonna undo this nut here. There we go friends, I've, uh, I've done the bushes uh, in sequence so that when I put it back I don't get confused. Okay, so that's that done. There we go friends, that's the second, that's the second bolt. And now we need to undo this clamp here, this one here, okay, and I've got the feeling that that's a 17mm socket to use on that one. There we go friends, that's the clamp we need to undo. There we go, nice and easy. There we go, last one. There we go. That's that out of the way. Right friend, this is a new ball joint, so we can extract the old one out, okay, and the clamp we got here, we got this one from uh, Amazon, so very useful uh, clamp, that's what we're going to use to push the joint out.
I'm just gonna apply some WD-40. This is our new ball joint. Okay, we got this one from our, from our local shop for 15 pounds. So that's what we're gonna be putting in. I've taken the gator out already so that we don't damage it when we push it in. So that's how it goes in. Rotate. And now we're gonna press it in with the with the with the press. Okay. friends so now there we go that's fully pressed in right friends now that I've put the uh, ball joint in there we go, just gonna slide in the gate like this all the way and then push it in like that Right, we're gonna place the axle stand under the new ball joint to push the pin in. Uh, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna drop the car down a bit to push that pin into the hub, and uh, then we're gonna lift the car up and then uh, scale the bolt. Right friends, now that I've uh, done the with the bolts, secured the um, lower arm, now I'm gonna do the linkage. So that's how we're gonna slide it in here, and then there's a bush which goes here, like that, just like that, and then the bush from the top. that goes in
There we go, just gonna tighten the just gonna tighten the linkage. Right friends, there we go that we have fitted the pole joint. Um, it was uh, a pretty much simple job to do. Okay, thank you very much for watching the video.